Welcome to another edition of Mac News. I'm Lance. And I'm Chandler. Today, Today is, is Monday, Monday, October, October 23rd. 23rd. October 23rd to October 27th will be our Red Ribbon Week. Make sure to dress according to the Spirit Days in order to show your support against drugs. Monday will be Crazy Sock Day. Tuesday will be Mix and Match Day. Wednesday will be the Decade Wars. Sixth graders will wear 60s stuff, seventh graders will wear 70s stuff, and eighth graders will wear 80s stuff. Thursday we will wear bright neon colors. Friday will be our crazy hair day. Why do we do this, you might ask? We have Red Ribbon Week to show our commitment to raising awareness against drugs. Red Ribbon Week is an alcohol, tobacco, and other drug and violence prevention awareness campaign observed annually in October in the United States. Now we're going to interview teachers and students about drug awareness. Yes, I've had an experience of drug abuse with my dad because he wasn't he is an alcoholic and he smokes mostly every day and that kind of separated our family and it caused a divorce. My uncle experiences drug abuse by smoking and drinking. My uncle was a heroin addict for like three years. Hi everyone, I'm Mr. Rogers. I'm assistant principal here at McElhaney and just some of my thoughts on drug awareness. I think it's a very important uh, week for us to reflect on the dangers of drugs and, and what it can really do to our bodies and, and our minds and it's one of those things where they're just very bad for our bodies and, and you know, our hope is that you're aware of that. We'll have our second lawn chair lunch. You will be able to hang out with your teachers and just have a good time. If you missed the first one, don't let this one pass you by. It's when teachers get to come out and staff and enjoy having lunch with the students. Lunch at lunch is uh, a time where teachers can take their lunch into the quad, but we actually get to sit in either a beach chair or a lawn chair. It's pretty cool to have all the teachers out there eating amongst the students and, and it's really cool when students come over and sit down and, and talk to their teachers and eat lunch with us. It's pretty fun actually because I feel like students have this kind of perception of us and what we do during lunch of how it's just kind of usually our quiet time or anything like that but it's a chance for us to get out there, mingle with the kids but also mingle with all the other teachers. Hey, lawn chair lunch on Fridays. Come out and hang out with your teacher and eat with us. Don't jump into the camera's view. We want to make this great for you. Don't touch any equipment. If you want to be on Mac News, email Miss Campbell don't try to be funny behind the camera. Don't interfere with the Mac News crew. Mac News works really hard to make weekly videos about the school and school news. Please be respectful behind the camera. Thank you. Hi, I'm Jaden. It's Amanda. We're about to go to Miss Batcher's room. Miss Batcher's the owner of Rock Club here at Dan and Bess. Let's go see what it's all about. What makes Rocks Club a lot of fun is that there are a lot of glitter, paints, um, just brushes, anything you need. My favorite thing about Rocks Club is just because all my friends get to hang around and just paint and be ourselves. So. Hey Chandler, did you dress up for Twin Day? You bet. Last Friday was Twin Day. Let's take a look back. Hi guys, I'm Ella Cannon. And I'm Emma May. And today's Twin Day. So we're going to go around and check out all the spirited students. Oh. Because it was what everyone had in their closet. <laughs> yes, from ASB. Everyone in ASB is a minute. Do it again? Yes. Yes, definitely. I think it's a great idea. Uh, because we're best friends. <laughs> <laughs> because we're best friends. Hello, my name's Casey and I'll be talking about the Great Shakeout. The Great Shakeout is an annual earthquake drill and millions of people take part in this worldwide. Here's Hunter for more information. Hello, my name is Hunter and the Great Shakeout's been happening since 2008 in California on October 19th. The Great Shakeout teaches kids how to drop, cover, and hold on. 
You want to go into your desk, hold on to the leg of the desk, and cover your head. Last Friday was pick out day. Did you dress up? Let's take a look back at some of the kids that did. To say, at least I did in my way. Lie way, too faced. But in my Good morning, Colts. It's Maureen. And it's Tiffany. And this is how DMS shows their spirit for pink out day. Let's go. Make sure to follow us on YouTube, Instagram, and Twitter. Our username is at DMMSMacNews. Hey Colts, do you have a secret handshake with your friend? If so, direct message DMMSMacNews on Instagram and you will be featured in Mac News. In the intensity performance, we will be competing with a lot of the other teams that are all-star or um, intensity. Thinking about their goals and what they want to do when they graduate from high school and what colleges they wanted to go to. And then we also studied about the requirements that they needed in high school to be prepared to go to the college of their choice. Remember, Remember Coles, lead the way. We'll, we'll see, see you next time. I was scared of dentists and the dark. I was scared of pretty girls and starting. No, thank you. Is what I should have said. I should be in bed. But. Temptations of trouble on my tongue, troubles yet to come. One sip. On Mondays, make. Dude, I know. I know. I, know. <laughs> Why is room? I can't hold it. <laughs> is it going? Okay. This is not helpful. I can't. Three, two, one. Aw, oh, dang it! 150. <laughs> <laughs> Good job! Good. Like a problem. Gorilla is a Greek. <laughs> Are you ready? Try again.